Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Asia Fina. I'm back with another super exclusive snack review. I want to give a quick shout out to my sister. Thank you, sis, for sending me these awesome snacks all the way from St. Louis. I love you, sis. As we all know, especially for the Asian viewers out there, these dry shredded squid snacks are like beef jerky to us. Because we, just eat, we can eat these all day, even though we give us frisk breath. So let's take a look at one of these. Um, there are different brands, two different brands right here. This is the Jane Jane brand. This is the hot version right here that costs two fifty nine dollars Central, which is Chinatown Market. And for this big bag, it's $5.29. It's also Jane Jane brand. Um, this one is, um, this is the squid version, and I believe these two are, they are all squid. But some of these are also prepared with cuttlefish. I had to actually wiki it because as it turns out, squid and cuttlefish are not the same type of species. It's kind of, they're like kind of cousins to each other. Slight difference in their uh, body structure. So this bus. Actually, let's check out the packaging right here. Um, this is three ounce on the back. Let's look at the ingredients. I'm pretty sure all of these contain MSG because it enhances the flavor. You can actually taste it. Like a squid, sugar salt, lacrose, sorbitol. There it is, monosodium glutamate. That's nutritional info, it's very small. And here is the bigger packaging. Just show you what the ingredients are. Yup, that's the MSG right there. Basically is the same, except without the spiciness in there. And on this different brand, this is the best quality food brand. I love these Chinese names. It's like everybody wants to be like lucky or best. And I'm pretty sure this also contains Yep, monosodium glutamate right there. Well, sometimes you guys have to take a grain of salt. Basically, these fish are dried and then prepared, marinated with all these spices. But it's a perfect snack on the go. And I have to admit, these are very, very fishy. I remember in grade school, I gave it to one of my friends who happens to be African American. He couldn't finish the whole thing, had to spit it out. That's how bad it was. But these I eat all day. Let's take a look at this right here. This is a proper piece right here. Look at how what the texture is. It's gonna be very chewy and very fishy smelly. But this is the hot version. Mmm. That's some good stuff. Let me tell you, that literally took like, I would say about like 20 something get seconds just to get it to a level where I could just swallow it. It's, it's not bad. It's what I'm used to, except it has that special spiciness flavor to it. I like it a lot. Let's open up this one. Usually they have a special cut corner where you just open it real easily. There's a huge bag right here. I might have to bring this with me to work. And of course I won't be sharing because nobody's gonna be eating it. <laughs> Here's, let me show you what a couple of pieces look like. Yeah, notice the texture is a slightly less colorful. Man, it's fishy smelling. Mmm. Good stuff, good stuff. Now this bag seems to be taste a little bit sweeter, which is a little bit surprising. But again, it's nice and chewy. This brand, I'm not sure I've ever had it before. So we'll see how they represent it. It's always got these packaging, keep them nice and fresh. Oh, this is double wrapped. Check it out. Is that really necessary? Oh, no, this. Fold it down, never mind. Oh, this has a special smell to it. It's a more distinctive smell. Look at this. Oh my goodness, this is a huge piece right here. 
Look at that stringy texture, kind of like rope. This one's definitely less flavorful. A lot, a lot less MSG, that's for sure. Tastes more natural. Hmm. Oh yeah, this brand is real nice. I'm really loving it right here. It's got sweetness, surprising, a little bit of spiciness too, but a lot less MSG and it just feels more natural. This is a good brand, yo. I'll be definitely looking out for more of these best quality food brand. So, like I mentioned, this is a very nice snack, but I would suggest for those who have guys never tried it before, buy a small bag. Keep in mind, it's very, very fishy, but once you overcome that taste, it is a delicious snack because it's packs high in protein. Yes, the downside is the MSG content. Sometimes you just have to be adventurous and try stuff. I mean, this is like a Asian food staple. Very popular in China and in Southeast Asia. I highly recommend that you guys go try it. Um, it's one of these snacks that's just pretty amazing once you get used to it. So let's imagine if this is a battle review, this brand would definitely win it. I would probably just give this a more of like 82%. On these two brands is more like a probably like a 79 ish anyway hope you guys enjoy this special snack review until next time take care of yourselves and as always be hard work harder baby oh don't you worry Kira I see you over there and of course I'm gonna hook you up with this generous piece right here not too much because it contains maybe some MSG but just for you to wet your appetite before dinner do you even chew? Come on, you're supposed to chew that and enjoy it, not just swallow everything that I give you, Akira. Come on, give it the program, yo.